Here's one of the worst positions a writer can ever find themselves in. In other words, sometimes coming up with that first sentence of that first paragraph can be one of the most frustrating, time-consuming aspects of writing. Well, here are seven, seven, seven strategies that are concrete and specific and guaranteed to get you off to a great start in that introduction paragraph. Choose one, follow it, and you'll find that that introduction paragraph flows for you, and then it's on to the rest of your great paper. An effective introduction has three goals. Hook the reader, provide background, and present the thesis. First, to hook the reader, try an attention-grabbing statistic. There are over 500 known species of marine sharks. An interesting example also works. From the enormous whale shark to the diminutive dwarf lantern, sharks come in many shapes and sizes. A brief anecdote works too. A lone surfer wades into cloudy water. The posted warning, shark sighted, foretells disaster. A thought-provoking question can draw in readers. Are great white sharks the most dangerous predators in today's oceans, or are humans? A powerful quote grabs attention. French fries kill more people than guns and sharks, yet nobody's afraid of French fries. Avoid vague statements at the opening that lack clarity. Since the dawn of time, humanity has faced many challenges. Instead, open with a specific, intriguing idea. Sharks have become the canaries in the coal mine for habitat destruction by humans. Dictionary definitions can seem weak and should be avoided. Webster's defines sharks as marine fish with cartilaginous skeleton, prominent dorsal fin, and tooth-like scales that feed on other marine life and plankton. Original explanations keep you, the writer, in control. Sharks are marine fish, not monsters, that feed on marine life and plankton, just like other fish. An introduction should also orient the audience by providing background context for the topic. Sharks have evolved for millions of years. Their cartilage skeletons, keen senses, and unique anatomy make them the ultimate apex predator. Finally, the intro presents the thesis at the end. Although sharks pose a danger to swimmers, we humans pose a greater threat due to overfishing, pollution, and habitat destruction. Our shark intro accomplishes all three tasks, it hooks the reader, provides background, and states the thesis. Please reach out to the Writing Center for more help developing introductions.